Nextville 363 a lot of people have been asking me to do a quadrant test so what I did was I downloaded quadrant and a lot of people were saying about how unreliable those results were so I'm going to run both the tests first I'll do quadrant I already did the test so I'll do it all over now this one doesn't take as long however the other one does so be patient <clears throat> I've also been asked a couple other questions besides the quadrant test um, but I'll wait and I'll add that at the end of this So, here's the results. The result is 2,304, 2,304. And that's comparing it with Nexus 1, Motorola Droid, HTC Evo, Motorola Droid X, Samsung Galaxy S, Nexus 1, and lowest one's HTC Magic. However, everyone always says about how unreliable this is. So now let's run it on. Uh... All right. So now let's do this test on. I don't know, Vol Volamo, Volamo. I don't know the correct correct pronunciation. Run the test again. <clears throat> now this one does take a while. So I'm just gonna let this run. Altogether, there are 11 tests, so it's gonna be, it should be quite boring. I don't know if you guys actually want me to run these tests or just post the results, so I'll just do both. <clears throat> Even though I don't know why, I would just rather see the results in the actual video process, but. And I don't know what any of these other uh, Flash Player websites besides Justin TV. If you guys leave me a comment or a private message and let me know. Because people said, well, let me see something else besides Justin TV. Well, I don't know what any of them are besides Justin TV. So if you can um, leave a comment below or send me a private message and let me know what these websites are so I can demonstrate them. Uh, obviously, right now. Since I'm at home, as I've explained in my previous videos, I don't have really good 3G coverage at my house, service period. So, obviously those would be run off Wi-Fi. Um, so, yeah. <clears throat> but, I don't understand the purpose of these tests. Maybe, I guess it's just supposed to show the your phone's performance compared to other ones. And while this is running, I'll just leave this down here. And I'm going to go get the specifications real quick because everybody was asking different ones. One good thing to know too is I'll leave this here. This is where the antennas are. It's where the GPS, Bluetooth, and the main antenna, which I always thought everything was on the top. 
apparently not. All right, it's still running on eight out of the eleven tests. Well, here are the specifications. It's still running in the background. I didn't touch it. <clears throat> so if you guys want to see those, there you go. So the biggest thing is the internal memory because the internal memory was crap on the Prevail. I didn't even have that many applications and I'd constantly have the low space error on my phone which was annoying because I'd always have to take away all the updates that I had on my phone. And no, it's not a beer or anything, it's a monster. And yes, this is very, very boring, but you guys wanted to see it, so. I guess I'm going to have to add some music to this video, because otherwise it would be really fucking boring. <laughs> this test is supposed to be a lot more accurate so maybe I'll actually have to wait no I'll just put it I'll put it in the description if you don't wanna if you don't wanna wait to see, watch these whole tests I'll put down the times for that you can click to alright so the says that it's 787 is my score so now it's going to come now it's going to put out the graph to show you where your phone is all right so let's see if i can get this all right so there's my score which is let me scroll up and it says 800 is that's where the line is and I'll just kind of pan this down I'm sure it'll look better on the screen but I'll just kind of scroll this up so you guys can see what it compares to So obviously there are phone. It's pretty comparable to the HTC Flyer. So there you go. 